Welcome back to JAS Madras. I hope everyone is doing great. In this video tutorial, I will be showing you how to download rainfall data from CHRS data portal. So the data sets will be given in a raster file format. You can directly use it for a mapping, preparing layout, etc. So after opening the browser, just type in CHRS data portal and hit the button search. So you can see here, this is the first link, uh, CHRS data portal. I'll be sharing the web link for this website in the description section. You can just check it out. Now let us visit this website for downloading the rainfall data sets. So you can see here, this is the map layer section where you can visualize the data sets as well as for uh, locating your study area, navigating. Now coming back to the data, here you can see around 5 data sets are available. So we are going to focus on 2 data sets. One is a Persian CDR data, uh, data, data type. So it provides, 30, uh, it provides the uh, precipitation data for 37 plus years uh, with a high resolution which is uh, useful in long term studies. The resolution of this data, you can just check in. It is a 0 0.25 degree into 0 0.25 degree that is nothing but 25 by 25. Each pixel will be covering 25 kilometer by 25 kilometers. And the availability of the data is from January 1983 to present. And the next data which we are uh, going to focus is PDIR now. So this is a real time data you can uh, directly download it for a uh, for example, if you need the data for today, you, you will be getting this. Uh, it's a real-time data and it is a high resolution data sets, precipitation data sets. You can see it is uh, each pixel covers 4 km by 4 km area. And you can check in the availability. So it is available from March 1st, 2000 to present. The main advantage of this data is PDIR now compared to the other real time precipitation data sets it is reliance on high frequency sampled IR imagery consequently the latency of the PDIR now from time of rainfall occurrence is very short that is 15 to 60 minutes so it is uh, having a uh, it is uh, taking images in a much uh, shorter duration compared to the re other real time uh, images as you can see here it uses high frequency sampled IR imagery it uses high frequency sample IR imagery so you will be getting the data much more consistently than others so let us see how to download the data sets first we are going to see the Persian CDR so it is for a long 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 term uh, studies because this available from 1983 to present so persian cdr you can see time step select time step if you want it daily you can select daily or if, if you want the monthly aggregated monthly uh, rainfall will be provided for example the precipitation during a month totally totally it will be aggregated and it will be provided in month wise and next is domain you can choose for whole world or uh, you can uh, select a region with a rectangular region you can select it by country uh, political division continental basin major river tributary watershed local location as well as you can upload the uh, shape file so you can see here you can upload the shape file or a kml file or geojson file so in this case i am going to choose based on political division so let us wait for a few seconds the political uh, division data sets will be loaded so I'm going to just zoom in to the particular location. For example, I need for this region. 
Kerala. So I'm going to just uh, click on the top of this uh, political boundary. As you can see here, after clicking, the region will be highlighted in the orange color. So you can understand that we have uh, the region has been successfully selected. Now you can see here uh, date time. You can give uh, any date time. For example, I need it for uh, the year 2000. Uh, let me go back to 1990. I need it for uh, November month. You have to click done. You can visualize the data. So the data will be, you can see here, the data has been given. So this is the aggregate for uh, 1990 November month data sets. Like, like this you can do, you can have a good uh, look at it. You can also turn on the legends in order to get a clear idea how much rainfall has been received. By following this uh, legend, you can understand how much of rainfall has been received. You can customize this legend by clicking custom legend. You can set the minimum and maximum values and you can also set the increment. Increment is nothing but the class size. For example, 0 to 25, 25 to 50 like this. So here you can choose maximum 30. You can select plot in order to customize the legend. So let me close this. Now in order to download this, you can see the option download at the bottom. Ch uh, check our download. Here you can select the uh, date time. So I have chosen 1990 uh, November month. So you can, uh, you can also download it for yearly basis. Yearly aggregate will you can download directly. Let me show you that also. If I click uh, yearly and you can also have a visual, visual of it. Let me click uh, visualize. You can see this is the aggregate for the year 1990. So this much of rainfall has been received. So you can see the color. So the rainfall is in, given in millimeters. Keep that in mind. Now in order to download it, once again select download. Here you can choose arc grid. If you are uh, using ArcGIS, you can download an arc grid also. Or you can directly select TIFF format and zip. Now hit the button download. So you can see here the data has been processing. We need to just give our email ID and click download. You can see, you can just click on this link and directly you can download the file. Let me save the file. So you can see here it has been successfully downloaded. Let us open it in ArcGIS and have a good view of it. Let us first extract the file here. Go back to GIS. Let me add the data. So this is the file. Let me add the shape file too. So it will be showing it doesn't have a special difference, but it is having. So let me hold the shape file. You can see here. So the pixel size is around uh, 25 kilometers by 25 kilometers. You can customize the legend. S sorry, symbology. Invert color. So you can see, you can have a look at the data. Let me measure the uh, pixel size. So it is almost uh, 27 kilometers by 27 
kilometers each pixel covers 27 kilometer by 27 kilometer so let us go back to the portal data portal now we are going to see how to download the pda pdir now so pdir now is a high resolution data it is providing uh, at a resolution of 4 km by 4 km. So here we are going to select the PDIR now. You can see here, if you want you can download in hourly, 1 hour once, 3 hours once, 6 or daily or monthly also. Monthly means uh, you will be getting an aggregate or if you want you can directly download yearly. So here in the case I am going to uh, select monthly and uh, once again visualization you can have a visualization of the data for example I am going to select 2023 and I am going to put October let me visualize the data how it looks like so this is how the data looks like for Uh, once again select to visualize so that was uh, I had not uh, click done so it is showing the previous data previous year's data now you can see here this is for uh, 2023 uh, 10th month you can see how the rainfall is let me turn on the legend you can have a good look of the rainfall which has been received uh, in the October month of 2023 you can download this data so for example I need it from uh, September month 2023 done to November month 2023 yeah hit the button download same thing save it let me extract the file pdir extract here so let us add that data pdir you can see for each month the data sets has been given for uh, September month, uh, October month and November month. Let me add the uh, November month data first. So you can see here. This is the rainfall. 326 uh, millimeter maximum and this is the minimum so here you can check the resolution so just around uh, 4.39 kilometers each pixel covers 4.39 kilometers by 4.39 kilometers so likewise you can add yeah let me add the 10th month's data that is October month same properties let us change the symbology for this also what color apply okay and this is for october month that you can see here 2023 10 2023 11 you can see the rainfall variation so this is for 10th month the aggregate for the 10th month is being given rainfall aggregate likewise you can download if you want it in download in real time we have to select daily and once again hit visualize here you can uh, visualize for today also for example 26 visualize for a, for each uh, for today you can directly visualize that is the real time data that to 4 km by 4 km high accuracy
okay for this state the image might be not there let me check on okay maybe the coverage because uh, each day it will be covering different regions so this region is not uh, i don't know i can't uh, uh, make the video much more longer but even uh, get the data maybe 5 days once i don't know exact uh, revisit period for uh, the region kerala so thanks for watching if you are uh, having any other doubts please do ask in the comment section goodbye everyone